I have a stream. I'm playing one right now, actually. So we're going to be playing two games tonight, Prince of Persia and Dynocity, both SNES pseudo classics. Let's uh, get that going, shall we? Starting off with Prince of Persia. It's a game that's known and pretty well loved, and for those that don't know, before its line of reboot sequelitis was had, was like six games, seven games, eight games. It was a lot of uh, a very beloved, one of the most ported of all time classic games. <laughs> okay, Drex says yes. Yeah, so those that missed the memo, I'm at Drex's house right now. By the by, donation incentive, as Drex brought up earlier. $100 equals C, the new burb of Retro, a.k.a. Drex's burb. I don't know. Anyway, so, like any true gamer, gotta set our controls real quick. Let's see, uh... I don't know what I'm doing. All this to special, there we go, and I think that'll do it. Kirk, I love you, or Gino, I love you too, as well, man. Alright, so... If you've played the game before, feel free to play along at home and then be confused by all the random fucking level changes they made to the game. Put up here. There we go. All right. This all looks the same. So the game, uh, so the original Prince of Persia, you have one hour to clear it and it's 12, 13, depending on who you ask levels. And this one is, I believe, 19 levels in two hours. Well, Drex and I are very, we've, when I lived in America, we were very local, so that's a thing. But for those that don't know that I actually follow on the, uh, on the Gurk news ticker, I moved back to California back in November. And that's, that's been a thing all its own, honestly. Yeah, Harrington, that's, everybody does that when they start playing. I have grown up with this game, I've played it since I was like six, so, this is actually, control-wise, is a very, very faithful port. So I, uh, I kind of know what I'm doing. At least it might not seem like it at times, but I very much do. Mega Man Five. Whoa! You missed Mega Man Five. Hoss! Red line. Sorry, Mother Huffing Gurk. I'm not in a place you like, though, Paul. I don't know. <laughs> so, spoiler alert: the sword was not here in the original game. The sword was like eight screens ago. It just gives it to you. Now we go into a weird underground dock cave or something. I don't even know what to say about this. Raid Hype from Creature Type Sorcery. I don't know what that means, but yeah. Ten people now watching. Hello, I'm Gurk. Hope you enjoy the stream. Almost high. I'm stabbing myself in the thigh. Geek and Drex in the same house, yes. Classic geek. <laughs> Gurk, yes. We all knew that. So, in one screen, we're going to be at the, so the screen where the sword actually was in the original game, which is right here. A lot of fun, that is. Welcome to the Retro Block Party. Hope you like it. It's only a dollar. That's right. I want to do that a lot. You need to change R to special. Use R to hang. Thanks to the, thanks to the freaking remake. So, a skirk fact about this part, I was going to do... I was originally slated to have the newest game of the marathon, which is going to be the 2007 remake of this game from Xbox 360. Sounds like the word dirt. This is the SNES version feature. DS. Seat the system. Alright, we have our sword now. No way it's to be instant death. I'm just going to stab the shit out of this guy. Sword fighting game was pretty, pretty simple. Uh, you push up to block an A or whatever button to attack, and also there's like a, a two-second bu input buffer. It's ridiculous. Dr. Mega Man, please, do not. <laughs> I've been hearing this crap all my life. You try going with, you try going with the name Gurk, and then you'll, uh, it'll become a thing. Alright. Level 2, aka the wall. Actually, level 3 is the big wall. All right, have fun with your food there, sorcery guy. But Gurk the jerk. Rex, I hate you. <laughs> I went the oh I, no mind. This was the it'd be the wrong way in the PC version. It's it's the right way here. 
So the guards in this dungeon are very, very nicely color coordinated. The color of their clothing indicates how good they are and how strong they are at sword fighting and how much life they have as well. Now we have the first non, you know, olive green guy. Although I don't know. I can't even see him, I killed him. How awesome is that? True bot party. I like that bot name. Oops, I went the wrong way. So, I'd say the map, the layout of the map right now is about, I'd say, 65% DOS game, 75%, and the rest of it's new by the devs of this one. Not Falcon, but some other dev. They did a really good job. They added a bunch of music and they added a lot of personality. In the original game, it's just a guy with white pants and a turban. And it was very clearly not the game developer's brother, Ocean Capping. The game was, even back then, well, well, even now I'd say, especially back then, was famous for its very, very, very fluid animation. Oh yeah, Polish, me too. I had a 386 actually, but whatever. See, the potion, the big potion, which gives you all your life back, and refills it would have been on that screen in the original. I'm a Kira, what's up? Hello. Can't remember which way to go. Yeah, I have, uh... 15 minutes left. Okay. Not that way, apparently. That sucks. Yep, I know that feeling. Didn't pay for it. Yeah, Paul, she probably had the cracked version like I did. I got it from my, my dad's cousin. Alright, fantastic, I'm dead. <laughs> That's why I played a line that could be a lot faster than this, Drex. Even I can beat in 18 minutes. Yeah, this game is very, very punishing. If you die, well, A, you die, and B, you, most levels you go back to the very beginning. Fun story. <laughs> I've missed Hamps! What's up, dude? Yeah, I've, I've missed streaming, honestly. I cannot wait till I have good internet again. Reliable internet. Man, I'm, I'm, my, my timing is, just, is wacky right now. So, as you may or may not have noticed, you have to get, like, a step running start when you jump. If you do too late, you'll, you'll like just fall into a pit. Really, list? I find that a little hard to believe. So, the rundown of my last known whereabouts, and like I said, in November, I moved away from Japan, aka the land of $10 gigabit internet. And I'm, for now, I'm staying with the folks, and, you know, I can't complain about that, except for the internet. The only thing, it's the only thing I don't really like about it, well, that and not having, you know, my own place. Oh, I also can walk through guys to change, to change places with them. <laughs> and, but the internet, because we live out in the freaking sticks, it is... The internet... Oh, no. <laughs> we live out in the sticks, we, we have like a... Uh, looks like a satellite, but it's pointed like somewhere on the horizon, rather than into space. It has really good ping for its type, but... It is two gigabit or two megabits down and half a megabit up. That's a lot of fun. Kitten Panda thinks I'm glad that glad to have me back too. <laughs> Seriously though, it's a lot of fun. These headphones are slowly slipping off. Oh my goodness, I missed that jump again. Yeah, streaming at 140p. Well, no, it's been streaming streaming on my, my cell phone's tether. All right. So I'm, I'm a little bit too late in these jumps. Really, I'm gonna blame the uh, I'm gonna blame the errors on Drex's monitor's delay, which probably doesn't exist, but for purposes of me fucking up, it does. Yeah, I cut off. Same guy. Oh god, it's polished. I'm so, I'm I feel that pain. Yep, same programmer, same designer, same everything. It's a one-man show back in the day. Jordan Mech... Wrong button. Wrong, wrong version. Alright. <laughs> Maybe... See, it's already spoiling me. I'm overestimating the amount I can do it late. I need to not... Not die. Okay, good. 
<laughs> Kira with a $20 donation. Have fun, comma, hugs. I will. Also hugs. Oh. That guy 10 minutes ago was on point when he mentioned the uh, Mega Man 5. <laughs> I get it now. As Drex has said, 80 more dollars for the bird to make an appearance, an actual appearance. None of these fake ones. Alright. I think I might have to jump timing down, uh, finally. I didn't get to practice this game at all. I was, uh, last night I was playing the remake. The remake, the jump timing is trivial. It's, he, he jumps almost instantly, it's ridiculous. jump. Normally in the original game, the uh, exit platform is right here. The exit switch is right here. We go down a couple more screens. Sound of the exit door opening. The weird sound. You need paper. Uh, Sheena just changed. Thank you for the heads up, though. Oh my god, I passed level two. Level 3. This level's the major wall in the game. I do believe this is where Drex Rage quit. Just regular quit, actually. A very tough level. Uh, as a kid, this is where I, I rage quit like, se like seven times because there was no manual. Like, like same, same, same situation as Polish, I believe. And I didn't know what the hang button was. And this is, this is the first level in the game where you need to hang. It. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's actually, yeah. By the way, Drex is no longer rage quitting, it's now Drex sitting. Being fucking outsmarted by a skeleton here. Go. I'm buffering. Ah! Oh! My life back with that vitality potion, which I need because I'm very bad. There we go. Erty, I mean, Gerx. Yes, that's me. Gap here, I, I want to not fall into. There we go. <laughs> I like that you get one warning if you try to step over a ledge, and he's like, oh. That was game pedal, God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually, uh, I, that's because I'm one of those. He was the computer guy growing up. You, know, you might think if you played the original game, but Gerk wasn't the, the big potion over here. That I say A shut up and B you're right. There's also one over here. This area with the weird Oops. slightly. Ah Outworld. Bye. Also hello. Also, in case you're wondering, in the SNES version, the gore is very, very diminished for these things. And by diminished, I mean it doesn't exist at all. Yeah. Okay, this is this is the major wall part. I guess it's gonna be all for nothing if I fuck this up. <sighs> like that! Well, I'm wasting time. All right. Um, at the risk of exposing my hubris, hubris, we are going to skip the bottom potions. It just takes so freaking long. Running out of time, both in game and on. I mean, RBP. I'll do. I'll do that at least five times tonight. Sorry, guys. Look at that, though. It's, it's like a stream timer. How long till I'm off? Which it's not. Splat. Yep. Pretty much. <laughs> a bottom left, Shin. Hopefully the overlay is not covering that up. Is the overlay covering that up, guys?
All right. The five mans. Five lives. If I, yeah, that's that's what it is. That's my life. Getting hit takes away one. There we go. And checkpoint. A little too late there. There we go. Let's head down this way. So a lot of this game, beating on time, is memorizing what the layout of the dungeon is, unfortunately. There's the exit door. We're clear to go, except it's like 20 screens away still. Not the case in the original, but they love to mix things up and make levels like twice as long for no good goddamn reason. Oh my god. Oh, this would be more shocking if I hadn't fought a skeleton earlier, but that's okay. In the original game, that's the, that's the person only skeleton. But wait, it moved, to, it moved aside from me. It's nice of him. Very nice of him. The original game falls in the hole and is gone forever. It plays the, the, the Battle 1 theme. This is a uh, heat seeking pulverizer trap, I guess. I don't know why it didn't trigger on the skeleton for the past five minutes. My only possible explanation is that it is, in fact, heat seeking. So there you go. And here's the exit. I'm like one sixth done with the game. I think because I'm uh, one eighth done with my time. It's a neat game, KPI. I, it's kind of a, it's kind of hard to get into because of how obtuse the controls are, but I do love it. Oh, whoops! Wrong version. <laughs> Shin, if he shows up, the, the, the dream is if he sh if Pepsi Man shows up, I will fight him. And I'm pretty sure he's partying with the, the Boyks right now, so. He's like three st two states away. <laughs> oh, whoops. That's uh, whoops number eight. So, three. Well, I mean, it's also an added wrinkle there, Shin, is that Pepsi and Dutch Pepper, are, they're kind of allied in California, so. By going to Nevada, though, yeah, the, the treaty is not standing. Leave that tile alone for no particular reason. Easy boy. Knuckles is a uh, fluorescent green coloring. Go. Yeah, check out that awesome MLG jump. It would be funny if I died there. I mean, right, right after that awesome jump, I mean. Oops, that was a mistake. There we go. <laughs> What's next? That's right. We have two, yeah, two loose boys. Well, I hate this. The SNES version is very, very bad about blind jumps, and I, I don't like that. Behold the games of glorious AI. <laughs> Respect Dr. Pepper. Well, fun fact, Dr. Pepper was, uh, he was a doctor, but he was not qualified to be a soft drink. A little, little bit of fun here. I kill the guy, this thing stays open forever. Yeah, Paul, sometimes. I mean, the game is really good about when that requires that, a jump always getting you across, like, there's no tricks. But, uh, yeah, I still, I'm not very confident stuff. 
is! Hello. Also, thank you. Oops. I tried to stop and it did not happen. Hopefully there's a checkpoint somewhere. In this I don't think I've ever actually died like after the first screen. And fuck. Really amount of practice. Spikes on the pooper. <laughs> Well, last of all, as they say, actions and words are something, something, I don't know. Let me bomb beep, I don't know. Go! Almost missed that. Was being the keyword there. The fun fact: if uh, they hit you and your sword's not out, you die. You take 90, you take 99 damage. Go. Ugh. Down here, I don't think there is. I want to check anyway. Oh, spikes, okay. <laughs> yeah, no, it's just a regular pocket. There's probably a massive hole in it from that sword, though. Neo? Or is that Vuva Neo 2000 Vuva? I don't know. I forget where I'm going. I believe this is where the two potions were, was it? In full kind of onesie. I assure you, it gets a little bit more complicated later. But then again, the greatest enemy in this game is, of course, gravity. Yeah. You can tell whether or not you can climb up by how the top screen, top tiles look. I cannot climb those. Those are just solid blocks. That one right there, I can. A little hint about the upcoming cream. Oh, God. Oh, God. I don't have $100 yet. Ah! Please donate eighty dollars. <laughs> Step up. What are you doing? <laughs> this was oh uh, well. I disqualify from Prince of Persia burp percent. <laughs> uh, Shane, this is Drex's house. So I needed that, those tiles to drop, which actually cancels out these spikes. It destroys the tile. Allows me to go safely down here. <laughs> That's Drex's burb, Cali. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. So, long story short, my internet at home sucks. I had to borrow Drex's place for two hours. And by that, I mean just his computer. Dream crossover. Yeah, what is this, a crossover? I mean, as we all know, Retro Block Party is the most ambitious crossover event in history. Well, somebody said that. I, that I may have actually dreamed somebody saying that. I'm not sure. Hit or delete because my internet sucks. That's the only real reason. Max is a good guy. Would recommend A++, whatever. I had it covered, but then it turns out my tethering internet kind of sucks. So, Whoa! No. Oh. That was the wrong way. Whoops. It's okay, I didn't die though. I just took one, one left. Mel, thank you for the raid. Or charity. Well, shit. I'm glad you're all amused by that. <laughs> I 
I don't know what to do here. I don't think I've ever done this before. I go here quietly. Okay, give me the forget about me. Ah, eh, fuck. <laughs> well. Barley with the Drex emotes. It's just Drex's house. Welcome, haters. That is true. I will say I'd be saying about this game. Uh, no idea. That's a thing, at least. Three eighty-six, just like my old PC. Actually, it was a three eighty-six plus, which is also known as a four eighty-six. Go. Everything should be open if I don't fuck things up. The door on the right here should be opened up, I'm not mistaken. Yeah, that's, uh, now the height fall is just one damage. But yeah, that's, uh, two, two infinite lives and then one on top of it for extra pain. Extra humiliation. So the, this is also known as the slowdown fight. I messed that up, that's okay then. <laughs> hello streamers, hello raiders, I am, uh... I'm a guy. I play games, usually. I'm an adult, I'm not part of your system. Hey, wait, why is everybody talking about PayPal being broken? Is PayPal broken? Is that why everybody's talking about PayPal being broken? Because PayPal's broken. What's your question, by the way? I'm, I'm uh, a little, little confused. Yes, kid, that's exactly what's happening. We have random mirrors for no particular reason. of want a secret. I don't, I don't know where to jump from. I always forget. So, you look at the bottom right, those four tiles, the four bricks, how they're, not, they're A out of pattern and B cracked. There's actually a hidden breakaway section there. I forget which one I have to jump from, the middle or top. So, uh, all right. I'm going to try the middle one, and if it fucks up, then I'm going to do the whole level over again. Actually, I'm not. There's reasons. There we go. Got it. <laughs> this is nothing but a big potion. Yeah, seeing in the original game, the big potion was hidden in a very obvious place. Not even hidden, it was just like, like on the way to the, the first major switch. Sorcery, 20 bucks. Thank you, buddy. The amazing work, all of you, but especially Gurky, uh, meant to say who didn't. So, yeah, come there a bit. Giant mirrors blocking your path. You, you jump through it, it takes away all your health and creates a weird shadow clone of the prince. And then you fight a bunch of guys in a row, but that's luckily not in this version. There we go. That's <laughs> wheeling and dealing. Shadow clone jutsu, yeah. Except, except a different person, you know, cast it on you. I believe this is level five in the original game, so we're, we've already fought. Like, they're gonna, they're gonna do one like original SNES level. By the way, guys, the blue posters are poison. Don't drink them. Don't do drugs, kids. I don't remember where I'm going. Much as I hate to say it, the memory of 
the DOS versus way more indelibly in my brain than this one is. Those are Pepsi, that's why they're poisonous. Soda's bad for you, kids. I remember now, I think. All right. All right. <laughs> Hey, remember what I gotta do now. Not not go that way. Enjoy Pepsi responsibly. Responsibly? My Australian accent. My Traz accent. My Traz my Traxent. Pepsi for TV game. Oh shit. And I'm dead. <laughs> Pepsi death death death. <laughs> well, Shane, in fairness, he has like he has the inside edge. He's watching the original stream, I think. <laughs> Jack said, "Jack said to leave the room laughing." I think not her sneezing. I can't quite tell the difference. I'm not not that he's bad at. It. I'm I'm just a weird robot that can't tell the difference. Look at that, the easiest, easiest guard in the game. There's magic floating platform here. How about that? Now we're getting tougher. Uh, Shin, I believe 19 or 20. Let's drop down this away. There we go. Checkpoint question mark. I forget what I'm doing this. I have to like be very careful. Ow, my back. Choice cereals. How many kinds of cereals, Lestroth? That's the real question here. So another holy shit thing about this game back in the day, you can walk through spikes. You can even run through them if you see them. Like, them not being instant death coated with micro spikes is just a, a, a huge mind blowing factor for me. This is not in the book. Weird ninja fight. The, what the? Ah, man. I don't know. There we go. Okay, I lost the rhythm there for a second. Just kind of do this over and over until you get a hit or you get hit. Ideally, not the last one, but... Pretty much good, yes. Alright, there we go. This game is my first ever true discovery what salt was? Oh yeah, I don't doubt it. Yeah! Prince of Salsia. <laughs> Alright, so that was another original level. Pretty much KP, yeah. <laughs> also, that's I'm I'm fighting to rescue the princess from the evil Jaffer. I, I was wrong. This is level five from the original game. Recognize the weird like four way thing. Also, just have this this just super jazzy like Arabian music. Arabian-esque? Arabian-esque? Yes, distraction geek cosplay. Stop it, Dr. Megaman! I want a half left. Timer's not quite as fast as, uh... It's as bad as Ballers the Kid from Star Tropics. Never played Star Tropics. All I know is that the bad guy from Star Tropics is a uh, racer in F-Zero. Also, you have to dip one of the one of the pages of the manual into to uh, water or some crap. Come on, dude. Please. There we go. Forgot about, forgot about me forever. <laughs> he just waddles after me. I'm, I'm just gonna be like, oh, you know, forget it. There we go. Star Tropics is the best. <laughs> Fuck with that kid. 
Sounds like Earthbound to me, buddy. Also, these. But. Drax has a lot of really crazy things. I think he's actually some kind of demigod. But uh, he has the world's comfiest cat. The world's fluffiest cat. And the world's comfiest uh, headphone. I keep falling off my head, though. Not very good headphones. They're good phones, though. Not so much in the head part. I think this one's loose. I'm not sure. It is not. His wash. Okay, so this is actually a pretty well-known, or not well-known, but people that played the game is pretty well-known, like, puzzle. You have to hit the blocks in a certain order, otherwise the gate opens up top prematurely. And... I don't want that. The gate opens up top there, the Shadow Prince comes in and drinks my, drinks my juice. I fucked up. That's okay. I don't need that stuff anyway. Yeah. Now he has four life, which, by the way, does not carry over. Just heals my juice. A big juice. I was so, so looking forward to drinking that, too. It's my big juice. It's my special day, damn it. I mean, darn it. I'm actually taking a lot of damage. I should be a, be a bit more careful anyway. <laughs> Later! <laughs> Profamity. Oops. Yeah, another original, original uh, stage. Okay, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I do remember these are loose, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, yeah. So, forget about those. KP the brakes. Pump them. I forget what I'm doing here. I think, I think I'm wasting time with what I'm doing. Probably. Ah. <laughs> okay, not that, apparently. Nope, so not that. <laughs> I go this way. There we go. Look at these awesome puzzles. That I'm kind of sort of... What's going on, chat? What the hell? That awesome, like, shimmy up that... Through that closing door. How amazing is that? Another fun... Exploit. Oh, that was one time. One one step away. Get against the wall. They can't block. You just get him in a fucking stun lock. You get him a damage stun lock. Beautiful. Rex is okay. He's uh, kind of disappeared. Just kind of. Gone. That was an accident. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, I think I, uh, I, I remember what I did wrong, I believe. I believe I remember. Did we retire struggle bus? I'm assuming we did, but that would be a great time to use it. Whoa! Shady streams with the raid. 
Also, Poker Jabba there. What's up? Welcome to Digdis. I mean, to uh, Herb. Herb. Boom. Ah. Ah. Stop it. There we go. There we go. Hey, Poker Jabba, what's up? Hi. Welcome. You have entered the Retro Block Party Zone, 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 Zone. That's right, that's for that. Guy in here I fight. Just opens that door for forever. Oh, okay. it's a game. Very, very trollish, that's a good way to put it. it. Has a very obtuse control scheme that once you master it, once you get used to it, it's actually a lot of, it's really intuitive and fun, but it's very tough. Especially this version, this one's actually harder than the others. Very, very easy to speedrun, though. I think it's funny that the current speedrun record for this game, the any percent, is older than YouTube. Like, it's from, like, 2004. It's from Google Video back when that was a thing. Before they bought YouTube. Look at that cocky motherfucker. Just, like, put the sword away, knowing that gonna, guy's gonna fall down. Which way to go, though? This way? Maybe? Open something. Very retro, yes. Although, fun fact, I almost... I was going to play the remake from 2007. But I was having 360 issues. Also HD capture issues. Get off my platform. There you thank you. I keep your entertainment. Alright, Harrington. Be safe. Etc. Okay, you take you take one damage from falls of two tiles or more. If enemies fall two tiles, they die. They take nine damage. Or however much damage is enough to kill for good. Ah. Aha! Now fade away! Or don't, I guess. Whatever. Yeah, I missed the potion. Who cares? Alright, here we go. This next level is the halfway point of the game. Officially. Kind of, sort of. I say officially because, you know, the original game was the halfway point. Yes, it is. So the original game, there was a, uh, you fought a very excessively fat god guard as, like, the, the mid-boss of the entire game. Oh, yeah, I'm the... So that game is a really in-depth password system, too, you know, because, uh, actually, it keeps track of how many minutes you have remaining, too, as, as well as your max life. I find out, is this a thing? I'm actually finding things out right now, apparently. Probably not, it looks like. Okay, whatever. This is the slowdown room. There we go. Also, some guy operating a weed whacker in the background. Good times. Oh, yeah. And it does it all in like six or seven or eight characters, too, which is really cool. Is hell game. I remember there are some absolutely hellish passwords. Like uh, I had a game as a kid on SNES called Super Ninja Boy. It had the really ambiguous name. Oh, whoops. In Japan of Super Chinese World. That's you know ninjas Chinese whatever. Anyway, so the passwords in that were like 35 characters, and they were. All kinds of wacky letter looking bullshit, and I don't even know what to think, how to think about that, you know? I 
Come on, dude. <laughs> so when I, when I swing, I am immune to conveyor belts and also apparently immune to gla grabbing things. Oh god, River City Ransom had really, really nasty passwords too. It's funny, a lot of Japanese games they have, because you know, Japanese has more than 26 characters, they have more than 26 letters for their alphabets. It's, it's weird seeing how devs, they compensate for the uh, different, like, it's, you can do, you can easily do, you know, uppercase, lowercase for 52 and maybe numbers or weird symbols, or you skip the vowels and do some weird shit. Whereas uh, Japanese, I think it's somewhere like, they have like 48 characters, I think, or something like that. Some ridiculous number. What the heck? I don't know why it's not... Oh, I think I know what it is. This is actually a bug with the game. I need to move when I get out of combat mode so I can grab again. Alright. Well, according to this, I still have 1 hour 20 left, and that, won't, that wouldn't lie to me, right? Now, come on, dude. Come on, dude. <laughs> 46, thank you, Omni. I always, I always read the exact number. There we go, that should do the trick. There we go! Right, Shin? Yeah, this is not in the original game. <laughs> Just FYI. Gold, I never even heard of that game, Lesta. Golvelius. Game, this game is very low input, like, maintenance. I, I can watch the chat pretty easily. Aha! Tricky shit. Go here. Jump here. Go on my treadmill here for a second. There's the boss room coming up. Remake to oh, where's the evil? Truth be told, I'm not a big Resident Evil guy. That's okay. I respect it. Oh, in Japan, Biohazard. Hey, cat, what's up? Just cat Yo-Yo was at my feet. Yo-Yo, oh. for those that are not initiated, is the world's fluffiest cat. I have no idea how it's so fluffy, but it is. Ah, oh, it's the big guy. <laughs> he has his own hit sound too. Oh. <laughs> Enjoy. I'm driving it's revel in it. Yeah, I don't I believe you cannot do in the original games. You can trade places with this guy. You can just run away from him. <laughs> you think so, Shin, but apparently not. Hmm. What a jerk! That's the exit. Just fall. There you go. Seven characters. No, you fight. You fight the evil vizier Jaffer. It's his name. I like to far with two F's, so it's Jaffer. Now I'm in hell. I died. See. <laughs> That's the exit. Yes. There we go, I forgot to grab the ledge. We're, we're, fight, we're fighting a world of, we're in a hell, aka modern art world. I don't tell you this, but the person's a very advanced art as well. Soft up the game, we have to uh die. <laughs> oh well. That's why I got lot yeah, it's well this one's actually pretty straightforward, Poka. <laughs> I 
<laughs> oh my god. It's stab. Only. Advocate. Hey, come on, dude. Cut it out. There we go. The guy could reach me, actually. There we go. All right, whatever. I don't, I don't care anymore. I'm so inclined I can actually just, just kill the guy by landing on him, but what fun is that? Oh, oops. Whoops! I guess probably should have knocked the guy out and then gone up. Yeah, that whole area on the right is completely irrelevant. Un Spoiler, guys. I don't think I'm going to beat the game at this rate. <laughs> just saying. I know the skeletons, they hold together under, you know, against the pull of gravity, but when they fall, they suddenly come apart. Pretty great. Yep, yep, yep. Oh yeah, Pulse. In the sequel, Prince Persia 2, Shadow in the Flame, you take two damage instead. That game, you have the sword the whole time. You can use your sword anytime as well, which is kind of nice. Oh, yeah, Marley. That was truly good at this game, honestly. Except for the world record guy. He's pretty fucking good at it. So good he's held the world record for, like, 13 years. Oh, by the way, hidden room. Wow, back in the dungeon. Now it's red. That is so Legend of Gurk. I agree. Oh, what the heck? I got the ledge. Oh, come on. Come on. Stop it! Okay, there you go. Now you've been stopped, Mr. Jubuff. Prince of Persia goes to hell. Dordon. Dordon? I like the noise they make when they get hit. It's very satisfying. Pum 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 pum. Uh, whatever. It's dead. Again. Probably. Is it truly dead? Who knows? Maybe it's just falling in the lava. It's, you know, treated to a uh, unending misery worse than death. And undeath. I don't know. Hold on, Zordon. I gotta fight this guy. There you go. Yeah, you have to change places with this guy so you can knock him off here. Yeah. yeah I, I don't know if it's like I don't know if it's ripstream or not, but yeah, ripstream probably. Oh, getting closer back to home here, as you can see. Psychedelic. Drex is probably in bed resting. There we go. Alright, I'm out of hell. <laughs> the same color as his vest. Excuse you, Polish. That was a switch for sure. Oh well. Ask the... I don't know where I'm going, honestly. I have to do here, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, I don't know what I gotta do here. Fine. Wait, yeah, I remember now. Okay. I have to go... Okay, so... 
Down there on the bottom, at the bottom of that chasm there, there is a closed thing for that door. I have to hit a tile forcing it closed permanently. I can open it for good. Which sounds really weird and intuitive, but uh... Yeah. Fuck him. Exactly. Winning advice from Jub Jub. Oh, I'm sorry, THE Jub Jub. Jabberton. Sir Jabberton. That'll do the trick. <laughs> there we go. Bikes there. Not at all subtle. Pay for your insulin. There we go. <laughs> the last one's a charm there. I dropped that tile too. Yes, I was. <laughs> that was fucking mean. Yeah, well, whatever. Maybe he has diabetes. Maybe he doesn't, who knows. We'll never know, because he's fucking dead now. Can't have diabetes when you're dead. Ah! Oh, I should push up to pull it back out. Wrong game. I try I thought he was ah, damn it. Oh my god. Wrecked. R E C K E T wrecked. I thought he had I thought he was dead. Really he wasn't to fight the opposite, I was dead. There we go. All that aggression, no problem. There we go. Oh yeah, I actually have to open the door. Whoops. Don't worry, shit, I'll get him back. Just you wait. That was a close one. This guy picked the worst place to fight. He really did. Both sides, he's fucked. Seriously, what the hell, guys? Guy. Killer. Alright. Rematch! I can have that Drex there. Everything here is spiked. I, I cannot go. So here, open that door on the bottom right. Not mistaken, anyway. Ow. Whatever, no big deal. Walk through these spikes. I did kill them with gravity and, you know, physics. I thought they made of squishy flesh. Gosh. Well, then that's open for good. Let's do this. He said minutes left. Well, not according to the game, but according to, according to the Retro Black Party, that's how we're looking. It's the salt will corrupt you.
<laughs> Shane, don't blame me for their their own crappy place to fight at, you know? I have no idea to open that thing. I don't even care. Oh, new new uh, hazard. Those things. Hello, Otter, and goodbye, Otter. <laughs> I mistimed the shit out of that. Is he better off with a visor? Lastly, exactly, that's what I'm trying to say. Also, good lord, there's no fucking, there's no, uh... Burned alive, then burned dead, and then burned dead again. Alright. I got it this time for reals, these guys. Don't you worry. Here we go. <laughs> I would if I could, Shin. I, it's just I'm curious what it looks like, but you cannot do that, unfortunately. Perhaps fortunately for them. Fortunately for all of us involved. I didn't even do that. He put it away on his own. I was like, oh, God. Hockey, probably. <laughs> all right, all right, here we go. Sixty-five minutes left according to this thing. The ten minutes behind is weird. This guy not fighting back. See, that's why he's driving the pit. They don't give me a good challenge. Let's just be glad that's not Princess of Persia. There'd probably be YouTube channels full of all celebrating all the ways you can die in this game. <laughs> Omni, I wish. Yeah, they have they still have loyalty to the Sultan. death, so we're gonna just drop down. Just the easy way. <laughs> Wait, what was it about the print leaving the princess the vizier? What if there was a game called Prince of the Person? All you do is just wait in front of an hourglass for two hours. Or one hour in most versions actually. For a person that may or may not show up. Alright. I don't know how to I don't know how to get that. So we had to skip some closed tile along the way, probably. Alright, we're, go, we're gonna play it safe. Not here. That one's easy. These ones though. He'll walk up to the thing and he'll step over it next time. And it's nice and boring. And we'll never see those traps ever again. What a great time to be alive. Let me ask you guys, who or what are you looking forward to from Retro Block Party? Jeez, thank you, Lesteroth. This level has a massive skip in it. I discovered myself, actually. So I'm kind of proud of that one. Chomp. The original game, these things have very menacing sounds, and when you get somebody, it's like, thunk, it's like, ugh. Skipping that. I'm gonna close that door. and not, not gonna have a good time. Okay, good, good enough, Shin. Yeah. Just curious. 
This has got a favorite streamer or a favorite game they want to see. This guy's, this guy's being a real pain in the ass. Oh, wow. Rude! Puts it away. Some good guy he is. One tile too late, too soon. That skips like two thirds level. Obviously, I'm a little out of practice, just a little. We match. I don't know if you guys noticed this, but the prince, uh, he spontaneously changes his clothes between levels. Something. They rude, they splat. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I'll do a little late. Worst case scenario, I make the jump and don't die. Whatever. Thing is the fire traps. S slow and easy does it. Wait, no, I think it. I think it goes this way actually. I think. One hour left. All right, there we go. I hope this game is very uh, nuanced and varied gameplay. But damage. That's the true way to do it. Oh, that's right. Yeah, if you. Uh... Loady mode, and I fucked up. Oops, there's the actual big potion. Whatever, no big deal. Yes. Uh, actually, no, still she dies. Um, the Vizier gives her a choice, marry him or die, and, you know, being of good mental character, or, you know, whatever it uses to. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. That was almost cool. I do say so myself, anyway. Ah! The blocks aren't going through. It's my fault, but still. Alright, jeez. Drex. Yeah, well, why can't you give... Oh, wait. They can't get bits. I don't know, he sent all the guards here to kill me. I don't know, I don't know why he killed me at all, why he didn't kill me. He just, you know, decided, hey, let's uh, put him in the dungeon. There we go. Too soon. Too late, actually. I don't know, Omni, he just does it between levels. Uh, do you know, cause I'm, maybe because I'm at Drex's house? I don't know. It's the only reason I can think of. I figured that, that's right. This is a shortcut if you did not change. Maybe it's just read from all the blessings the guys I've killed. It's like a pacifist run thing. It's like Undertale up in this bitch. The... <laughs> the more you kill, the redder you become. <laughs> yeah, there you go, yeah. Well, Drake's spell backwards is Gurk. E oh, here we 
we go. That. Oh, my life back plus one. Yeah. E okay. I am a Drexel house. True genocide. Yep. No, I missed one guy. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna be, play it, do it the boring way. Skeleton. Radioactive man. Skeleton man! His weakness was walls. Who knew? Okay, that's okay. I thought there might be a secret up there. I saw it cracks and the every tile except that row. Pepsi man! Oh, wait. <laughs> man, man. Mm hmm. It's over there. I would commit blasphemy, but, uh, reasons. I, I, I might be being under surveillance here, I'm not sure. Alright, I think we're out of hell? Yes, we're out of hell. Now we're in God Eaton. So in the original game on DOS, there was a guy here who would not, you could not hit him. You had to actually drive him into the pit. He would block everything without fail. We called him Rainbow Books. He wore like four different colors of clothes. Me being my brother and I. Yeah, she's playing with a mouse. It's her. It's she's like the princess from Voltron. She has a psychic link with mice. Assuming that's what it is anyway. It, it, it does her fucking bidding. Sure, why not? Yeah, that's the wrong way. Whoops. At least it doesn't pay for that, but with death. Oh, there! I paid for that with death. Never mind. <laughs> I should have uh, pledged a dollar for every death I have in this game. What are we up to now? Like 20? 30? Look at those awesome, like, sensor spikes. Pretty much, yeah. Well, the charm, the charm traps just do nobody's bidding. They just kind of, they just they, they show up for work and they do what they love to do, and that's that. <laughs> that split second, the guy was like, "Oh wait, he just fell through." Never mind. Right. It's for shame. We're not gonna use any more charm traps, or will we? Probably not. I mean, I can't remember if any that are very, very convenient. Bisected a man! Oh, I learned a word today. Bisected! Okay, if that guy falls down, that's like a soft lock. You can't get past him without him hitting you when you land. Where'd it go? This level is not very fresh in my memory. Ow? Question mark? That's right. <laughs> I went the wrong way. I went the right way by, by sheer chance. There's the door. Let's switch for that door over there. And the one that's closest to me. There go. Tobor, this is the uh, Nisk version for SNES. The U USA one. Wait, is this... Is this thing running at like a weird like 45 frames per second again? No ow period. I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna take the high road. I forget which one's the right choice. Well, not that one apparently. All right. <laughs> Wait, unless. Yeah, it is. 60 frames a second, buddy. <laughs> you might be thinking of Prince of Persia 2, actually. 2 had a, two was notorious for running too fast. Oh. Yes. Oh, I see. Ow! Ow exclamation point. Okay. 
No, it's one, it's one, it's one. Two is infamous for running too fast on SNES, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, yeah, that one runs hideously fast. I never thought about that, Toolboard. I'll, I'll give the PAL one a try. I, I love Shadow in the Flame. That's actually a really fun game. The DOS one's obviously ideal, but it's really tough to get running these days. Sonic Edition. Dude, no, Sonic is made to go fast. That game was not. It's really awkward. I'm <laughs> not even kidding. Oh, this isn't, this isn't fucked at all. This one's too slow. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm not. I'm not. I'm just defending myself. <laughs> yeah, it's because the devs were Titus. They're shit devs. Weird dreams? Is that the one where you're like, your guy's like on an operating table and if you if you die in the dream, you die in real life or some crap like that? What was the point of that? What was the whole point of this segment? What the hell? Slow. Okay, here we go. Oh, finally, you can't grab that ledge. All right. <laughs> yeah, I've seen a playthrough of that, an LP of that. It is something. I don't think I'm gonna clear the game, guys. Sorry. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. That dude, yeah, pretty much. I'm gonna come over here. No soft locks for me. There we go. <laughs> no pass for for me, huh? What the heck? Ooh. Let's start playing, guys. Let's stop playing. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. <sighs> the struggle may or may not be real, guys. Yeah, sword fighting in 2 was really tough, especially like when you fought things that weren't like guards later. Snakes and Medusa heads and shit. Oh my god. Yeah, 2 goes off the fucking rails with like enemies and stuff. Fantastic fact though, you know? Oh, I see. Because yeah, the No, uh, on DOS and DOS, it's the same way. It's that game. I remember playing it on Mac. I had the Prince of Persia collection, which, which it was a uh, DOS and uh, DOS and uh, Mac collection on CD. And there was a bug in the Mac version of that where you would start taking damage for no reason, like after you got to a certain state phase of the game. Game actually impossible to clear, if I'm not mistaken. Did you have that bug too? I, I was really curious about it a few months ago and I looked it up online. I couldn't find anything about it. A Mac obnoxiously. <laughs> I see. I don't know. 
don't let's go. I don't let's go this let's go the bottom way this time, huh? I think it's just, think it's just uh, an alternate route, maybe. Maybe? Oh, okay, I think maybe you're one of those obnoxious people that like was like, Oh, the Mac's better! We have no viruses! Nobody cares about get programming viruses for Macs. Or whatever, you know? Yeah, the, the non-grabbable tiles here look weird. <laughs> I see Corruptus. Wait, Daggerfall. Oh, man. That's Elder Scrolls, what, two? This! One was Arena, right? I, I'm uh, not honestly the largest Elder Scrolls fan, honestly. Yeah! Big drink! Which turns to a small drink in his hands. Excellent. Arena, Daggerfall, Morrowind? And... Oblivion and Skyrim. Oka! Have a good one, dude. Yeah, that fleeting hours is a good time. Redguard! Redguard! Oh, this is a 2.5. That expansion for... A whole place for a minute there. The Elder Scrolls Red Box. That counts, I guess. You won't count Fallout Tactics. No one actually does, but hey. This, this whole area seems pointless. I, I, I didn't even get to do the thing. Here we go. Got it. Face isn't counted. Shin. Is your real name? Well, open the door, and I'm stuck. Game of soft lock, time to quit. <laughs> oh, there's Daffer. Yeah, now I'm super fucking stuck. But wait! I said, but wait! I have to, I have to wallow about pointlessly for a few seconds. Get both. There we go. Yeah! Mouse buddy did a fucking flip. Some blue skin. Oh, went the wrong way. Whoops. It's a mouse from the princess. Alex is fucking intelligent. Tell Trek's floor mouse saved me. I uh, will, I guess. I don't know if that, is that a relevance of some kind? Yeah, but uh, yeah, I'll tell him that. I'll let him know. My old friend. Hello, hello, Minxer. What's up? Welcome to Rub. I'm sorry, <clears throat> excuse me. Welcome to Brushable Block Party. Oh, Flower Mouse. <laughs> I get jokes. I believe the door before the exit is now open. Creatore. Creatore? In Latin? Welcome to Slowdown. Population us.
Come on, come on. Stop, stop hitting me. I just want to go home. I have no idea what's going on, guys. Sorry. I knew I should have traded putting in the fucking spikes. <laughs> right, Lesteroth? That's a very valid point. There we go. Jeez. Oh my god, it works. Wait, no. That might not be it. Hold on. Kick his ass! What's up? What's up, y'all? <laughs> oh, I did it. What the fuck, man? <laughs> oh my god, I hate this biome. I fucking hate this whole game now. Alright, here we go. <laughs> I had to kill the guy. What was I supposed to do? Like, just turn away and not kill him? It's his fault for being with the visor. Jaffer. Level 9 from the original game. We you some weird, some weird voodoo bullshit. Oh, what's up, man? Hey, gravity killed him the second time. If an apple falls in your head, do you shrug and blame Newton, or do you fucking start a fight with a tree? Prince of Persia is tough. <laughs> I'm struggling a lot. That was, that was just dumb luck there. I'm killing too much for, uh, for Shinseto's tastes. Oh yeah, Argon Coyote. This game takes place before the OSHA existed too, so it's that. Oops. No, <laughs> the third option. You don't marry the goddamn Prince of Persia. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Come on, dude. Let's get in the trap. Thank you. Oop. You walk through those casually. I was just saw through a boot. That knuckles in that icon candy. A little confused, just a little. Yes! Come on, dude. Look at that. There we go. Big boss got 50 beers. There's no there's no drunkenness in RBP. Maybe there is, but not not endorsed by it, I guess. Yes. Aha! Oh, I messed that up. Okay. All right, all right, here we go. Fuck this noise. Jeez. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I think I got it figured out, maybe, hopefully. There we go, I made it. 
Holy crap, I'm awesome at this. Uh, Drex's apartment? I don't know. I go down here and knock down this tile, which makes it all worth it. Oh, opens that door forever. You got a nugget. T -t 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 -t. I don't, I don't get the nugget thing, but that's okay. Honestly, the Dixon tunes are fucking classy. This is just gaudy as shit. I'm assuming it's like classical Greek architecture, probably. What a lot of people don't know is that Greek architecture is loose. It's fucking gaudy. It's fucking ugly as hell. All their statues, like from antiquity and shit, they were all painted. I got a nugget! <laughs> oh, thank god. Wait, shit. Okay, good, never mind. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. This is actually a fake potion. Right, oh, this is, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna use it anyway. Shoe puff. Oh, never mind, that was, that was the real potion, never mind. Play it safe here. I think this is, this is a fake a fake wall here. There we go. That's like Arabian architecture. Of course. Can't go wrong with that, huh? Okay. Note to self, don't drink any more potions. They will just... Oh, a potion. Let's drink the potion. Well then. Everything's normal. All my controls are reversed effectively. That's great, though. Easy solution. I just turn the controller upside down. Probably. It's fucking disorienting. All right, all right. Uh, okay, let's let's end this nightmare for once and for all. Okay, well, that was fun for like two seconds. Stranger Things, Stranger Things bullshit. Oh man, I missed that reference. Opportunity. <laughs> we call that we call that Australia mode. I should have two seconds ago, but oh well. Ah, damn it. Whatever. Doors promo open. I miss. I missed Australia mode apparently. Yo, that's a thing. That's a thing, and we're out of here. Da -da 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 -da. Oh god. You don't fuck around here. Oh, and I died. What a complicated way to open a door. Right, can you imagine working here? Jesus. Working in the Persian dungeons? Uh, 15, I think. Don't worry, I still have 35 minutes left. That, that, that clock never lied to me, right? What an amateur here, right? That's a lot of time lost there, Minxer. I'm on I'm on a real life two hour speed run as well, so. I remember this this, this thing has uh warp gates in it. This is a really weird level.
I can't go that way, whoops. out and fell. Warp gates, yes. Okay, what's on the right? Let me check again. <laughs> That's right, okay. Pancake of Persia. <laughs> Ah, uh, missed time opportunity there, right there. All right, sounds good. <laughs> I know it wasn't about that, but I'm gonna assume it was anyway. Eel son, thank you, buddy. Now there's a shortcut from the entrance to the level. Warp gate. Not my face, please. Okay, so, they... okay. so we are in the backslash door. Okay. We gotta go this way. Ooh, a space portal. No, it's just it's just a uh, dark, snowy night is all. We gotta put this guy here to keep the door closed the whole time. Weird well, as that may sound. The guards aren't going through, I don't know why. There we go. That was closed forever. A minute ago. Hello? Stole a spike, never mind. <laughs> Stole a spike! Okay. Now we can go even further out in that, from that first gate. This game has some really weird, simple puzzles. Oh, that's right, it's after, after this dude. That's right. Where you jump out of the Hollywood Blondes, Bucker Jabroni, Hulk Hogan. Uh, we want to go to Flag or Weird Backwards 3. Actually, I'm going to take a third option. Hey, I remembered something. For the... Backwards 3. Miss guys, while I'm doing this fight, what looks off about, about this tiling in this room? Yes, the rubies? If so, you're absolutely correct. Right, right in the second row there. Oh my god, a hidden passage. Whoa! I think space portal though, for real. Nah, it's just, it's just outside, it's snowing in Persia, you know. Circle? I don't recall where I gotta go now. Not, not intended input, that's okay. I'm sure a door along the way or something is now open. <laughs> I'm not saying it's aliens, but it was aliens. Not that one. It's clearly aliens. Where the fuck am I going? I don't know where I'm going. I 
I got a nugget! <laughs> I think it's over here. Slowly avoid that. We're from weird shruggy face thing to ba V. There we go. God, oh man. I, that would have been terrible. That's right. That's right. Hey, <laughs> raviolis. Behold, loose tiling. You gotta go find a different way. Oh, hey, it's the shadow, shadow bro. It's for life. A pretty infamous guide, guide, dang it puzzle. Actually, it's actually easier in the SNES version. Can't fight him. See, in SNES, when he damages you and you hit him as well. So, yeah. I have gained the power of inexplicable flight. <laughs> Blue Man Group, yeah. No, there's one later. You'll see him. Maybe. If we have time. <laughs> oh, God. I don't remember any of this shit. I want to say it's here, maybe? This is aliens. That was a thing, yep. Yeah. We'll never speak of that again until the sequel. Pinnacle of taste in class. Oh yeah. No time for you, buddy, sorry. Oh, not that way. Is this whole thing a dead end? Jesus. Never. Flat. This way? It was not that way. That's okay. Nice flat. Place so we're building with alien and we get a very different story. Could be the music game squad squad. Also, Olmec's not a boss. He's a boss in part two. Not this one though. Alright, not that way either. Lots of blind jumps that are not fatal, luckily. <laughs> luckily. There we go. Or fuck. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Alright, well no more spikes, I guess. I guess. Here we go. Probably. I kinda of remember now. I know I know there's there's a we'll see in a second. I can do that too. Be gone, fiend. Well, an alien right. What? What kind of accent do you have? Fivo? Vil Villian? Villain? Adeline? You know what? I, I, I give up. I don't know. There we go. This is a, it's the, what appears to be a pointless part of the level. Again. That was not supposed to happen. I don't know why my guy decided to pull out a sword rather than keep going down. That's okay. <sighs> Oops. <laughs> this game does have a little bit of fresh any control sometimes. Only sometimes. An alien five was here being a red god. <laughs> Whatever, dude. You know, I, I, I will have no part of that. Yeah, I fucking I got pit tooed on that on that shit. Alien. Feeling like a villain. Heal in. Alright. Speed things along because we have like 11 minutes left, unless the guy after me is, you know, having issues, in which case, 
Good for me. <laughs> No, get something, Gurk. Kappa. Hi! Amethyst Rose 28. What's up? Honcha. Uh. Oh, okay, okay. I didn't die. Okay. Good, 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 good. <laughs> Welcome back, indeed. The, the death scream in the original DOS when you're, when you're taking a fatal fall is pretty great. Ah! <laughs> Welcome to DGDS. <laughs> Drunk games done as slowly, slow, slower, slower, soon. I might be in trouble here. I'm in trouble. Boo! RBP. Oh. All right, third time's charm, as they say. <laughs> That's about right. Yeah. Purple man group wants his fucking revenge. All right. I'm gonna limp to the barn here. I want to get to the next level because it's so ridiculous. I will. I will not get. To, I will not get to the end. I know that. I know this now. Fucking last. Uh, the last level in this game is, or the, the last like puzzle level, which is pretty much the last boss of the game. It's fucking stupid. Stupidly dense. No, we have not Argon. They really get creative at the end of the game. It's nuts. Never. Pretty much. It's an interesting game. Played the foundation for a weird mini genre that includes such hits as Flashback and Out of This World and Another Dimension and Flashback and also Another Dimension. <laughs> the extra architecture. Oh, yeah. You know it, buddy. What's up, sick Jake? Some revenge right here, buddy. There we go. So here we have a redundant loop here, unless... of warp. Wow. We skipped an entirely overly long and frustrating puzzle. Oi, yep. <laughs> Lesson this game is uh, pay a lot of attention to weird things off in walls. That's not graffiti, Lustra. That's actually a natural formation on the rocks. It's just a weird coincidence. It spells like uh, three English words. A thousand years before English is actually in the language. <laughs> or KP is gonna take responsibility for it. Whatever. And he fucking sucks. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's why he's, he got kicked upstairs because he, he can't fight anymore. He just commands. Honestly, you want to put all your guards at the very beginning of the game. That's where that you might escape from. Whoops. Here? Uh, whatever. What? Smack. Yeah, it's actually from something from part two. They weren't quite sure how to work with it yet. A duck walk under them. Why, what? I don't know. 
you think so, Max? Right, here's peak what in this game. Sword fighting? Fucking forget it. I'm gonna drop skulls on him. And also have really fucking weird hit detection. There, this is every bit is I cannot provide any context for this whatsoever. It's, this is pretty much as <laughs> Goro doing this game. Uh, Goro has uh, forearms. Excuse you, racist. Check her outworld or privilege. I don't know. There we go. And then he turns into bluestone and explodes. There we go. Okay, we're going to uh, take five minutes here. <laughs> I will not clear the stage. Just FYI. Prince of Persia, SNES passwords. <laughs> here we go. Okay. I'm the cheat. Set button. Let's see. H477 ST7. That stinks. What stinks? Am I cheating? We skipped two levels. Actually, one of them was just a, one of them was just a boss rush. Cheat war! Yeah, I got I got four minutes. We're gonna we're gonna beat Jaffer and get the princess. Apparently, his winning move in his pajamas is to warp us to the Coliseum. Is the world's worst time projectiles. You have to block them, like, super early. Yeah, I think I'm dead. Okay, no. He, he, he randomly can or cannot, he will or will not kill you if he hits you with one of those. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Just checking, Rose. This is this is the this is pretty much how this fight goes. I don't think you actually win win a uh, scrummer with them. Space so far, yeah, pretty much. Walls. I have an hour to go. Wow. <laughs> Ball cheese. Yep. That is how you beat Prince of Persia by cheese. <laughs> Just like a true two D fighting game. And the mouse can come too. <laughs> well, he trained them too well, Shin. The tyrant Jaffer lies defeated, his power shattered. Throughout the land, the people of Persia hail their princess and the brave youth who saved her from the force of darkness. 
No longer a stranger, he shall from this day forth be known as... Prince of Persia. Oh, there you go. Hooray! I beat the game. I only had to cheat once. Title dra Yep. Great way to end the game. I drop in the title. Like how movies do nowadays where it can't, it like completely slams shut and it's just the name in the middle of the screen. Voice actor. Look at all these, look at all these treasure memories. During the shadow. And weird ninja girl that doesn't ever appear again, except in the boss rush. Kirk. Chardmuck, what's up, dude? Brother. Hello. I hate to use this phrase, but just in the nick of time. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed Dinosity. Oh, yeah, it was great. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All those alien dinosaurs and shit. I just assumed that we went forward in time. Okay, yeah, oh, yeah, thing. I mean, yeah, this, this is about, this is Prince of Persia, I mean. Oh. That Dinosity was in the desert. Yes. And I just, I just thought it was a crazy question. Well, it does have a desert level. Well, there yes. you go. All right, anyway, hi. I'm good. How, 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 how are you, Char? Okay. Oh, that's the question I was about to ask. Well done. Well done with the uh, Prince of Persia run. Oh, uh, that, that Gaul said to go stuff me, apparently. I'm not sure if that's a euphemism or not, but... <laughs> All right. Uh, Gurk, do you got anything you would like to share with chat before we pull in? Uh, uh, thank you for all the donations, guys. All the support. All the good, dumb jokes. And uh, a special shout-out for Drex for allowing me to borrow his house and computer. Also, uh, buy my book on sale tomorrow. Nice. Are you going to have a signing? Can we come get a signing? Yes. Awesome. I'll be there. All right. Cool. All right. I'm going to scoop Go. up Gino. All right. I'm going to do some so I'll say bye in the meantime. Lesseroth and Gull and Five O and Sheen and Game Squad Squad and Kitten Panda and all the others, like Ark and Coyote and Lady Goggles. And Zordon, who's back right in the nick of time, dare I say. Gino. I appreciate Hey, it's Mr. Drunk Rotom himself. <laughs> and I am in the legendary Gurks zone. Zone, 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 yes. Zone, 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 zone. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? I didn't realize you had a voice. I, God, apparently I do now. Sweet. All right, cool, cool. <laughs> you know, what, uh, what are you going to be gracing this with? All right, so since we've been doing a lot of console games, and uh, Gurk was ever so kind as to put in a PC game, we're going to keep that truck rolling, and we're going to play some Commander Keen 4. All right. Or the, the one where they get good, right? Or the one where it gets really good. If anybody uh, remembers anything about Commander Keen, they remembered Ka Commander Keen 4. Yeah. And then, if we have time, we're going to go on a little bit of a, an additional computer-based uh, journey. Everybody knows it. It's Oregon Trail. Or Oregon? Oregon Trail. That, that, Not Oregon that's, Trail. That's, that's, that's a different game. That's Oregon. the sci-fi version, right? It's Oregon Trail? Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. Cool, cool, cool. We get, we're all going to get space dysentery with <laughs> the intergalactic Oregon Trail. You have died of space this century. I'm sorry, you have space died. Anyways, <laughs> it is that space time. Space broken your leg. All right, guys, uh, let's go ahead and uh, let's do the countdown. Kirk, you know what to do. I believe I do. I'm going to count down from five, right? Yes, sir. Count down from right five. And then when he is done, Gino, go ahead and count up from one to five. Okay, wait, wait. Do we end it on one or after one? Uh... You can say one last thing and then and then turn. Excellent. Five, four, three, two. Thanks, everybody. Gotta go now. Bye. One, zero.